As COVID cases continue to spread, doctors are experiencing an increase in multiple respiratory viruses. Hospitals like Henry Mayo are trying to navigate a surge of influenza and RSV. In particular, influenza A, which is packing its emergency room. We've seen a huge increase in influenza right now. Influenza is widespread. I mean, we're seeing probably uh, 40 to 60 cases in the emergency room every, every day. The respiratory syncytial virus, also known as RSV, is experiencing a surge across the U.S. Unlike most other common viruses that cause upper respiratory tract illnesses like bronchitis, this particularly causes more illness in the lower tract and causes a bronchiolitis. Uh, it's more prominent among kids who are less than four years old. As of now, there is no vaccine for RSV, which is another challenge that hospitals face. Resources are limited because of this surge in RSV, um, but for the most part, um, they just require oxygen, and so as long as we can provide that for them, um, they usually typically get better within 24 to 48 hours. As for COVID this year, doctors are seeing an improvement from last year and are hoping it doesn't become severe. We're going to have a surge in certain cases and it's going to drop off. The question is whether it's going to mutate again and become more pathogenetic. That's the concern. There are precautions that residents can take in order to stay healthy. The best treatment is prevention. And so I think the, the, the best word of advice, especially as we get into the holidays, is make sure you get your flu vaccine. And obviously just practice good hygiene. If you're sick, you want to stay away from your family members. Right? If you're sick, um, uh, then you might want to wear a mask around other people. Try to avoid very large gatherings if, if you need to. But the reality is, is the holiday season, is it's, it's about the holidays. For Canyons News, I'm Asia Haskins.